Welcome back into WKYT Summer Grilling. We're here at the world headquarters of the Kentucky Beef Council. Our thanks to our friends at G&J Pepsi as well. Here's our friend Chad Hedrick. You see him on the news yep. each and every night. Yep. Where, where is home for you? Ashland. Ashland. Yep. So that's why we have you today mm -hmm. talking about grilled tequila steak pizza because yeah. it's an Ashland fave. No, it is. 606. <laughs> <You're> great. <laughs> but this is something that you can fix and yeah. fix it up any way you want. Tell yeah, us about it. Absolutely. It's the marinade is super easy. Just okay. lime juice, tequila, and adobo sauce. Okay. Something super and simple. And adobo is the peppers, right? Yeah. Got a little kick to it. Not too bad. All right. Well, so we're hold, gonna put it in there. All right. Well, hold on a second. You All work right. tonight, right? I do. All right. Hang on. We don't want you messing with this tequila. <laughs> There's one way. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna put it all in here. Yeah. And the good thing is with tequila. Now, this is what I learned from watching Food Network, because that's what I do. Yes. Is the alcohol burns off. So you you're don't, not going to have to worry about Yes, you don't buzz. taste it. No, it's, it's a just flavor. flavor. Thing. Yeah. It's a flavor thing. Mm -hmm. And so then what you do under normal circumstances right. is you would take this. Mm -hmm. How long would you marinate it for? At least 15 minutes, but up to two hours. So you really get that soak in that flavor. Right, right, right. So this is it's flat iron steak, right? Yes. Flat iron steak. It's one of the most mm -hmm. versatile. Yes. Okay. And that's why you get it. Mm -hmm. It's really tender. You don't have to do it like overnight or anything, right. but you do want to flavor it. Right. And if you want to do this normal circumstances you do it for how long about at least two hours really kind of enhance that tequila flavor right right and so then what you do is you just drop it on the grill drop right it on here. Yep. okay so, so here we go we're gonna do that we've got oh, oh look at that look Take at this. that bad boy off we've got our tortillas as we say it in the 606 you do say that in the 606 we do. i understand that we're gonna the thriller in tortilla boom okay and then we're gonna put this on here get yes. it going Look at Chad. Chad Look can at actually me. do this. I can't. My, my mother will be hear that sizzle. Boy, he is really into this now. I mean, this is really good. That is All right, I'll close a the flavor bomb. All right, now, uh, through the magic yes. of television, right. we've already got some steaks, so mm -hmm. assemble one for All right. us. So first, we're going to put the steak right there on the... On the cheese. You can use your fingers, too. Oh. This is a family show. This is. We're, we're all family yes. at KYT, right? Right. Here. Perfect. That. Perfect. That perfect. Right there. That's really good. Mm. And you want to get some of the corn relish? Yes, we've got some tomatoes, cilantro, corn. To make it like a street corn. taco. Yeah. Super easy. You can carry it around at the pool. You've got, well, you don't want to get in the pool with it. Well, not, no, but like when you're okay. walking around, like socializing. Okay. And then. Cilantro for garnish. Bam. I learned that from Food Network Emerald. too. Bam. You do yeah. the Emerald glassy thing? Mm-hmm. You know where Emma oil is, don't you? I'll tell you as soon as we get through with this. Okay. All right. So, Chad, this is Chad's recipe. You can it find it on WKYT.com. Mm -hmm. You can see Chad each and every night on WKYT. Watch. And we will see you next time for another WKYT Summer Grill. Thanks. Thanks.